than in this moment. I am so tired, but I knew that if I didn't wake up early and get this day started early, then I wasn't gonna like accomplish everything I wanted to do. Also, I realized it last night, but it is August 30th today, which means that in two days, it's gonna be September. I feel like these last couple months in the year always just like you blink and they're gone. I wanna start the month of September off strong. So this entire video is gonna be a little reset of pretty much my entire life. I literally just wanna reset everything, get myself mentally ready and everything around me physically ready for this new month. Um, and yeah, let's go get some coffee first and foremost. And then we're gonna go ahead and get our lives together. I got what I usually get. I get my ice cream macchiato, but today I made it a quad shot because I need the energy. There's a lot to do. They even gave me a free pumpkin muffin. If you haven't tried this muffin from Starbucks, go try it. It is so freaking bomb. Can't get any more fall than this. I literally haven't accomplished anything and I'm already in a great mood. Pretty much the main reason that I wanted to have this little reset for myself is because I don't know about you guys, maybe I'm the only one, but I feel like as soon as it hit September for the past like four years for me, um, September, October, November, December, every single like routine that I have or just like all the things that I do to keep myself productive, I feel like just goes out the window. And then in January, I get this big like, oh, like let's get our life together for the new year type of vibe. And for the past like two years, I've been telling myself like, no, this is a year. I'm not gonna let that happen. I'm gonna stick to my routines. I'm gonna stick to, you know, all the things that I do to help me continue being as productive as I can and just, you know, stay in the right path sort of thing. Um, and it never works. So that's why this year, this is our year. This is my year, okay? This is the year. We're not gonna let that happen. And that's why I like really wanted to start off September with just a reset. So like I'm already taking the initiative to making this, you know, a good time. I just feel like there's always a point of the year where productivity and good habits just go downhill. I don't know. I'm gonna get a pedicure right now. I just called and they have availability like right now, right now. I brought my little chanclas and yeah, we're gonna get a pedicure. I really wish I would've brought my book to read while I'm getting my toes done, but I didn't think it through. got my toes done and I went for a baby pink color instead of just white today and I don't know what it is with this pink color but it looks so much better than what they look like with white so I'm definitely gonna stick to my baby pink from now on I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's hopefully that's like a two second trip and I'm gonna go home home now and this is where the real like reset part of this video starts because I need to organize I need to clean I need to declutter I need to journal I need to plan out everything before I even say anything I want to show you guys my Amazon cups that I got the other day it comes with like four of these cups and each cup comes with a glass straw it's so cute it took me so long to get them just because I was like why am I gonna pay that much money for just four freaking cups like i'm not even gonna use them it was around like 1 a.m when i was on pinterest i was just scrolling to pinterest and i swear every other picture that i would get had these cups in the pictures so i ordered them and no regrets so far
all I want to do right now is take a shower. So I have my candle going. I'm going to play some jazz music and I'm going to hop in the shower and feel and pretend that I'm at a spa. never going to wear this. First of all, it's like dripping glitter and it's super itchy and uncomfortable. So even if it was cute, it's uncomfortable. It's gotta go. Okay, this bomber jacket, I bought it like three years ago. I'm also not big on like colors and stuff like that, especially on a jacket. I'm gonna get rid of it. I actually love this. I'm still not over the whole, you remember like three years ago when these types of sweaters were like the biggest deal ever? I was so happy when I found this at Paxson. It was like $40 and that was like a splurge for me back then. So I'm gonna keep it just cause it's still pretty cute. Here's where it gets tricky. Like, <laughs> I definitely don't need both of these, but like they're different. That's why I've kept them for so long. I feel like they're different. This one is a lot heavier and a lot like more oversized. This one, they're also, they're like a different color. The zipper's black on this one, not on this one. The sleeves are different. The sleeves on this one look like that. And this one doesn't have that. Okay, if I don't wear it this fall or this winter, then I'll get rid of it. So when I do a closet clean out for like the new year, if I still have these and I haven't worn them, I'm gonna get rid of one. I thrifted this coat last year and I'm still so proud that I found it. This is definitely staying. This one's cropped and this one's long. I love both. Okay, this hoodie has got to go. 